Every year in the spring, people get ready to go commercial fishing. Some people are set netters and drifters. I'll be showing you how I set net for sockeye salmon. Thousands of people across the world come to Bristol Bay, Alaska. Bristol Bay has the largest salmon runs on earth. Every year, an average of 38 million sockeye salmon return back to their homes to spawn. My grandparents ended up getting some sites in Naknak, and so after 14 years of them set netting, we try our hardest to not get mudfish. There is some years where we get mudfish and some years where we don't. This is my fifth year being out in Naknak. Hey guys, um, landed about two hours ago, and this is the boys' cabin. Sleeping right in there. We got my clothes in there. We got some people in there. Person right there. And yeah, there's still a lot more people. Not a lot more people coming, but a little bit more. Um, show you. This is the crew cabin where we eat and uh just hang out that's the boss's cabin right there and uh yeah i'll show you the scenery yeah so the fish haven't came through the bay yet so we're just waiting on them to come and yeah i'm stoked uh, i've been coming out here for like about four years or five and i just love it out here um there's a cannery like three or four miles that way and so hope you guys enjoy this video um i'll try to do my best on it and hopefully we'll get a lot of views so this is where we keep the tires right here this is our shower this is our captain's cabin and then we're making another outhouse right in there and then this is the yeah guest cabin or couple's cabin yeah this is it. This is Knack Knack. Um, yeah, so just waiting on the fish to come in. That's where we keep our nets. And yeah. Beautiful day. Catch you guys later on uh, when we go catch fish. See you guys in a little bit. Bye. cannery this is our locker and yeah tons of stuff in here and yeah, so chest freezer uh, body freezer and there's more cabins on this side of the bay fishing and yeah it's just a mess out of here and there's a bunch of stuff out here all there's a bunch of there's probably a total 55 lockers in here something like that somewhere around there but yeah so i'm just gonna plug in this charger and uh i'll try to show you guys around the cannery so see you bye this is where they keep a bunch of their stuff trucks for the fish got skiff yeah a bunch of stuff. Another bunch of crap here. We got they keep a bunch of drifters in here. There's about a total of probably 20 drifters in here. And yeah, a bunch of crap everywhere though. Dude, they took so yeah. many boats out. There's a bunch of boats. Usually there's a lot more. Yeah, that big old red thing is filled with I think water or gas, something like that. And yeah, the big old containers over there. Right. Yeah, this is pretty much it. That's where they do all their fish right there. Yeah. For right now, setting the nets. Um, it's nine o'clock, 
and we have a fish opening. Um, yesterday we had a, another opening and caught about 1,800 pounds of worth of fish. And now we have another one till uh, 6 a.m. So we're gonna set these nets, see how we do. Here we go. It's on! After just putting the net in, we just got a fish over there. Somewhere right in there. Oh, as you, you can maybe. Good. Beautiful day. We got done with that 25. Now we're putting this other 25 on this outer. Doing good. Seal on our net already. Because Eating a fish. Setting this other net. And yeah. This is how we catch fish. Set nets. Sunset. If you guys can see it, but there's tons of drifters all along this bay getting ready to fish. Coming in, that's our tender. And we got another tender over there. And then there's just a bunch of other skiffs fishing, getting this stuff set up for tonight. And yeah, we're catching some fish on that inner one. Internet and yeah, those are our cabins far over there. And yeah, that's how we do it. Knack knack. Putting the net in this boat. This is how we do it. We're putting two uh, 25 fathom nets in this boat. And yeah, this is this boat. This boat's called a honey badger. And then this one, this boat, I don't even know, this boat doesn't even have a name. But yeah, after we do this, we're going to head in, go to bed, and see you guys tomorrow. Right now, <clears throat> just waiting for high tide. It's a, uh, High tide is in like about 30-something minutes. Beautiful sunset. Uh, some of the boys are heading out on the skiffs picking through the nets right now There's not a ton of fish on the nets right now, but there's a good amount um, Me and my cousin Jaden We're gonna be uh, beach picking <laughs> and I'll show you guys how crazy it is out in Mac Mac, Alaska. First one in the net. And there's just tons of fish. And they just started hitting, I mean they're just hitting, there's fish right there swimming in the water. through the 
fish net, and there's just a ton of fish behind me. They're everywhere. These fish are everywhere. Look at all those heads and tails on my left. Tons of them. Starting to rain. Of course. Just a ton of fish. doesn't stop. So right now, we're waiting, because these waves are just way too big. It's just gonna go over our waders, but there's a ton of fish on this net right now. Uh, hopefully you can see it, but like over there, at the end of that creek, so, uh, we did hit 100,000, so subscribe if you are watching this. Uh, hopefully this video is really good. Uh, yeah, and I'm gonna take a, I'm gonna try to take a really good video for this because there's a ton of fish on here. So see you guys in a little bit. We're having problems. These waves are so big. 
that the tote is filling up with water. I mean, these waves are probably about three feet tall. Some of them are probably hitting four. And there's, this net is plugged. I'll just show you this net. Like, fish everywhere. You have to pick all these fish. The fish are everywhere. Heads and tails. I'm just doing a quick video because I'm not going to be able to use it. But this is how many fish are in this net. And yeah, we had to pick through it. Right now, let's crush the net. We got one, two, three totes full of fish. We got a full one right here. We got some in there. Full one of that. And there is a ton of fish. And finally, uh, my back is killing me, but we're still doing good. And it's starting to get dark, and low tide's at four, and right now it's, I don't even know. So, uh, enjoy this video, man. It's a backbreaker. Right now, we're getting ready to go head out again. We got about six hours of sleep. We got done at 4 a.m. last night. A lot of fish on this creek, inner creek. It's probably a hundred right here. Maybe more than that. All oh, heads and tails. Now I'm tired. We're almost at 200,000 and Today might, today we might hit 200,000, so <coughs> we enjoy it.